Hey all, welcome to Shad Freak. This is Raj here. Uh, friends, I try to bring you uh, the latest information on HIV therapies and uh, HIV vaccinations and stuff like that. Uh, today I have some more information to share with you. Uh, I apologize at the onset itself that I might sound a bit nasal because I'm suffering from uh, seasonal allergies. I have taken the medications but it's not yet kicked in properly. Uh, that said, if you are interested in hiv uh, related information the therapies and all this is the right place to be on youtube uh, we have the largest collection of all the therapies uh, that have come up uh, we have made videos on everything and we continue to drop a video every week uh, and also motivational videos for uh, people suffering from diseases like diabetes hiv which are chronic uh, so please uh, take the time to subscribe and press notify so that you can join this uh, wonderful channel and get up to date information on hiv that said let's get started <music> Welcome back friends. Excision Biotherapeutics uh, Inc has announced that its uh, CRISPR based therapy EBT101 has shown promising results in preclinical and uh, bioinformatics studies targeting HIV proviral DNA. The company will present its findings at the American Society of Gene and Cell Therapy that is ASGCT at their 25th annual meeting in Washington DC. The conference starts on the 16th of May 2023 and it will be an exciting time for all of us following excision and their HIV therapy. I expect to see positive results and that would mean absolute uh, absence of off-base editing which is the bane of most CRISPR based editing uh, therapies. That said, we have covered EBT101 earlier but I'll just give a quick uh, uh, revision of what EBT101 is all about for anyone who's watching our videos for the first time. Uh, EBT101 is an innovative clinical stage therapy designed to cure HIV infections with a single intravenous in infusion. It utilizes an adeno associated virus or AAV to deliver CRISPR Cas9 and dual guide RNAs which target three specific sites within the HIV genome. A bioinformatic analysis presented uh, in the ASGCT uh, poster demonstrate that EBT101's target sites have no identical matches in the human uh, reference genome. Therefore, there is uh, no possibility of uh, uh, off-base off uh, edit or anything of that sort. Uh, the analysis also indicates a minimal number of candidate off-target sites with only one potential site exhibiting three differences from EBT101 target sites. These findings suggest that EBT101 has a very low risk of off-target activity uh, prediction confirmed by in vitro and in vivo studies showing HIV excision without unintended editing. That means uh, it doesn't have uh, the off-base off edits uh, happening so far. Uh, Dr. T.J. Uh, Craddick, uh, Chief Scientific Officer of Excision and lead author on the poster, stated that the presented data at ASGCT showcased the advantages of Excision's uh, therapeutic approach uh, through meticulous uh, in uh, silico design. EBT-101 was developed to minimize viral escape and off-target effects by precisely targeting three sites specific to HIV genome. Excitingly, EBT-101 successfully eradicated latent viral reservoirs in multiple disease models and resulted in functional cures in uh, transgenic mice. The company is now focused on advancing EBT101's phase one of two clinical trial based on these promising results and looks forward to discussing their program with the scientific community at the ASGCT meeting. The ASGCT poster that they have uh, prepared is titled EBT101 uh, achieves robust CRISPR based editing of HIV pro viral DNA without detectable off target effects and it will be presented during the hematologic and immunologic disease uh, 2 poster session. The poster authored in collaboration with researchers from Temple University and Dartmouth Hitchcock uh, Medical Center will be available on Excision's website after the presentation uh, is over at the meeting. So friends, uh, it's an exciting time for uh, uh, Ex Excision Bio and many people who are watching HIV therapies are keenly observing uh, the proceedings and are anxiously looking forward to the 16th of May uh, to see results of the data and I think uh, that will be a 
inspirational moment for many. I hope uh, EBT 101 uh, succeeds and uh, the poster presentation gives us really positive data that we can look forward to. With that said, my friends, I'd like to bring this video to an end. Hope is eternal. There are scientists working on an ongoing uh, basis on different approaches to defeat the HIV virus. It's typically like a Marvel universe of superheroes fighting a common Thanos. And in this case, the Thanos is uh, going to be the HIV virus and excision, AGT and VIIV. They're all trying different approaches to defeat this common enemy. So sooner rather than later, I think we should be able to have a... a, a choice of functional cures and potentially a sterilizing cure. Of course, cost is going to be a big issue, but uh, we'll cross the bridge when we come to it. First, we need the functional cure in place uh, to improve the quality of life of all the patients who are suffering from HIV. With that said, my friends, I'd like to bring this video to an end. Please seriously consider joining our uh, uh, Patreon uh, account so that you can uh, fund this channel and help us continue with this initiative of bringing you the latest information on HIV therapies and vaccines. We have three Patreons so far. I'm really grateful to all three of them and uh, I wish that uh, more would join us uh, so that we can keep things going on. Thanks and have a great day. Bye for now.